Welcome back to Marcus at Work Media. On today's episode of Charleston White Reacts, we have Charleston White talking about your boy, Little Romeo. And it has a lot to do with how he's been treating his father, Master P, in the media, Talk about he's broke and he's not in position and he's not doing great. So it's been a lot of celebrities that kind of spoke on it, a lot of uh, YouTubers and a lot of public figures that spoke on it. This time we have Charleston White giving his thoughts about the equation. You know how he going to do it. As a black father, as a black father, He's been involved with my kid's life since day one. Ever since I shot that boy out these nuts right here. That boy come from right here. I put him in his mama's pussy. So I just want to say, say, listen, somebody tag Master P. Somebody tag Master P right now. Uh, I stand with Master P, homie, as a black father. See, when you got one of them old spoiled ass kids like that little boy Romeo, little spoiled motherfucker. Little old bitty small motherfucker, he been entitled, ain't never had to struggle for nothing. Nigga, your daddy took $10,000 from an insurance policy and became a multi-millionaire. Your daddy just didn't feed your household, nigga. He fed many households and many other kids. For you to grow up, nigga, you really like a Nickelodeon baby. Now, I'm saying fuck you, Romeo Miller. Nigga, I'm with your daddy on this one. That's why I tell you sometimes you gotta say fuck them kids. Remember them kids grow up and go to talking how Romeo talk him? Take his motherfucking ass out the wheel. Don't leave his motherfucking ass shit. If that little boy is Romeo Miller and he's struggling from check to check, he dumb and stupid. And did, listen, didn't the boy go to college? Say, Romeo, listen, nigga, you went to college. Your daddy put you in a position, nigga, where your daddy ain't got to give you nothing, nigga. Fuck you talking about. Now, here it is. And I'm in the airport right now. But, nigga, I just heard Master P, nigga, and it break my heart that a nigga son will grow up and bite on him like the way you biting on your daddy. All you spoiled motherfucking kids, nigga, 50 cent kid, a Will Smith kid, nigga, you need your ass kicked. You nigga, nah, you nigga need your motherfucking ass kicked. Nigga, now think about this, nigga. Your daddy done put you in position, right? Didn't you have a rap album? You say, well, I ain't got no money because my daddy had to pay taxes. Who been feeding your long head ass? Who been feeding you? Then you complaining about, oh, uh, we been staying in the same house since I was 18. Say, stupid ass kid. Listen, that's a sign of a man that has stability, that's stable. You know how many people wish they can stay in the same motherfucking household from when they were 18 years old? Nigga, that mean your father have been stable with stability, maintaining what he done got. Nigga, fuck wrong with you, man. I hate you, spoiled ass motherfucking kid. Boy, can me and say, man, me and my son will fall out like a motherfucker. Nigga, I done pumped this dick off. Why done pumped this calm off into your mama? But you know how hard a nigga got to work to bust a nut to make a baby? Say, now nah, listen, do you know how hard a nigga got to work to bust a nut to make a baby to get one of you motherfuckers on earth? You know how, you don't know how many pumps and humps that nigga humped on your mama, nigga pumping that dick off and her to make you, nigga. Then when you get here, nigga, you know how much energy you take from a nigga when he calm? You know, all that calm shooting up out that dick. You know how weak a nigga knees and leg get to get your little stupid ass up? And then when you get here, nigga, your daddy is a millionaire. Boy, you, when I hate you, motherfucker, you don't know what it like, nigga. To go to bed hungry. Nigga, when you get on earth, your daddy, Master P. Uh, body, 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 body. Nigga, your daddy's Uncle C. Murder. Your other uncle, Silk to Shaka. Nigga, you were rapping with Bow Wow as a little bitty boy. Fuck wrong with you. What are you complaining for? 